Hey, it's Rick Khan from rickkhan.com. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to avoid audience overlap in Facebook ads. So for those who don't know, Facebook audience overlap is when you have the same people in different audiences. For example, if you have an Instagram audience, a Facebook page engagements, or even website visitors, and then let's say you create custom audiences for retargeting each of these, uh, let's say you then run the same ads that lead to each ad sets with these different audiences, then this is called overlap. Because the probability of some people who have visited your website and gone to Instagram or even gone to like your Facebook page, they're gonna be in these different audiences. And when this happens, Facebook will show that same ad you're running in each ad set. And since these people are being shown that same ad over and over again, it then fatigues your ad faster and then costing you more in advertising. So what's really happening here is that you're paying for the same person to see the ad twice. This is driving your ad cost up and fatiguing your ads faster. So the question is, what can you do to avoid this? Now, the best way to avoid Facebook overlap is to use campaign budget optimization campaigns that have ad sets with audiences that have the probability of overlapping, such as retargeting your website visitors and social media visitors. You see, if you were to use separate budgets in the ABO campaigns with an audience that could overlap, Facebook can't navigate and stop this from happening as opposed to the CBO campaigns. The CBO is designed in a way that you can put the multiple ad sets into the campaigns and then it won't affect any audience overlap. It's one of the reasons why Facebook recommends you use CBO campaigns over ABO. So you wanna make sure you set your budget at the campaign level, as it doesn't matter which ad sets you put in. Now, here's the thing though. Let's say you create two separate CBO campaigns, and then you separate the budgets across these campaigns with overlapping audiences within the campaigns. Now, since the budget isn't centralized in one single CBO campaign, this again will overlap and fatigue your ad fast. So make sure to put these overlapping audiences, all the ad sets in just one CBO campaign only. But with that said, if you're running multiple variations of offers and you're running different ads, then it's fine to run separate campaigns because essentially your prospects then are seeing different ad creatives and they're going to different offers that won't fatigue. Now, a quick bonus that I wanna give is for when you run your cold audiences because what you want to do is avoid audience overlap as much as possible here, especially if you're using big budget. What I tend to do is to make sure that I avoid any audience overlap is by creating exclusions in the custom audiences, excluding my website visitors, my email subscribers, purchasers, social engagers, because doing this will make sure that your ads are only in front of people who have never seen or heard of you. This will essentially avoid any issues with overlapping. Now, just a quick final thing before you go. If you're watching this video, you're obviously an action taker who is learning to improve your ads and other marketing processes. And what I'm going to do is give you the best strategies completely free. But the only way you can get these strategies is if you subscribe and hit the bell icon. That way it notifies you of any new videos. And also, if you think I forgot anything, just let me know in the comments below and I'll do my best to reply. And until then, I'll see you in the next video.